this time if we have the children uh, come up for children's message. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. How are we doing? Good. Good? Now, I have a question for you. Um, what are these? Magnifying glass. Is, does my eye get bigger when you, you see that? I can't, I, I don't see Oh, your that. eye is gigantic. Look at that. Wow, I'm too close, too close, right? Avery, oh, I think I see your, yeah, your eye is really big now, right? So, you know, magnifying glasses are good, right? Especially when you get older, you know, when you have to read our, our Bibles and our books. Um, you know, I wear contact lenses. You know what contact lenses are? Yeah, no. I've worn glasses since the first grade. It's been a long, long life with prescription lenses. But the point is, that's not the point. The <laughs> point is, is that magnifying glasses help, right? Why? Because when we look at the paper here, and we look at a, and we use the magnifying glass, it makes it what? Bigger. Bigger, right? And you know, when you look at the magnifying glass, Aaron, see that? Yeah, you see it. All right. Um, you know, your, your focus, you know, your focus is on those, on those words, right? When you use a magnifying glass, are you looking elsewhere? Are you like, oh, that's great. I'm glad to see what it says. No, you, when you're looking at a magnifying glass, you're looking at that person or that word and you're saying, that's what, it, that's what I'm focusing on. That's what I'm looking at. Now, when you're at church, when you hear God's word, when you study God's word, when you read the Bible, it's kind of like that. It's kind of like your magnifying glass, right? Where you are focusing on, well, Jesus. That's right. And that's everything, you guys. <laughs> you know, John was in a terrible situation. He was, he was in prison for standing up for the truth. And the only thing that gave him hope was looking to Jesus, focusing on the very word of God. And that is your word too. Because as you look to Jesus, you look to what he has done for us. You, that's right. And that is, he died on the cross, forgiving you of all your sins. He rose on the third day, to give you life that is forever. And as we focus on that word in the midst of the world that we live in, how much of a comfort it is to focus in on Christ and what he's done. And that's all for you. So kids, remember that this day. Through all things, we always look to Christ, the one who died and rose for us. Yes, magnifying glasses. Let's pray. Dearly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this time together. Lord, bless these children as you continue to grant them faith in your word. Lord, as they look to your word, grant them comfort as it points them to Jesus. It points them to the, your forgiveness that you have won for them on the cross. Bless them and keep them this day as your Holy Spirit leads them by your word. We thank you. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.